Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Disc Golf Examiner. Today we have Jonathan Ray, the Chasing the Chains tour driver. How are you doing today? I'm great, man. Good Happy to, to be here. It's good to see you back in Pittsburgh. We're out here at Chinley Park today. How'd the event go so far? Do we have a lot of people show up? We did. We were pushing right at 30, which for a weekday is always a pretty good number. I mean, our, our goal, I think, is 25. That's kind of that good break even good point yeah um but yeah we had a lot of walk-ups a lot of new casual people in the park so that was good that's cool we do have a lot of people this is a big college park we have a uh, university of pittsburgh nearby so it's really good to see other people come in and maybe try out the sport you know check to see what this is about and see if they're, they're interested in it because it is right here in their backyard absolutely this is the end of your season it is it's been a long season again for you uh anything new or interesting happened this year um a lot of new things happened um we kind of changed up the schedule a little bit this year and uh we started to run a lot more c tiers and b tiers as opposed to just doing two dish challenge events and doubles and things like that that we've done historically so uh, that was a good change um steve-o uh owns the franchise dd franchise down in texas and he kind of pioneered the flex start friday event which is a flex start where people can come out from 10 till five you know six or whatever on a friday and play the round it's a pdga rated round it's $22, and he's been averaging 100, 150 players every Friday night wow. um, at that thing. So uh, we kind of stole one from his playbook and started doing that and, uh, and have, done, have done really well with that in popular disc golf towns. Okay. And then in smaller markets, it's been lower, you know, 40, 50 maybe, but which, which is still great. You know, people mm -hmm. are excited about getting rated around. So uh, that's been a good transition for us this year. We're going to do more of that next year. So today we came. We grabbed two discs from your stock here. Uh, we went out and we played a round of disc golf here at Shenley Park. Uh, I was with Zach Schweitzer. I was with Adam Couture. Uh, we also had uh, Lenny in our group. He's gone. He's back right out now. on the course again. He's yeah. back out there. He couldn't get enough of the disc, so he had to right. go back out. There you go. So, um, whenever you run events like this, you go to so many different places. Do you see a growing number of people playing, or do you see, you know, what, what, what do you experience out there? It's, um, I think the 2 days challenge, I think it, it may have gotten a little stagnated to an extent, mm -hmm. um, but with how much disc golf is growing, there are constantly new players. These are events that are perfect for new players. These are events that are perfect for people that are fans of our plastic, or of Latitude or Westside, because it's a great deal on plastic for them. So um, the numbers have held pretty solid throughout the years and uh and i think we see a little growth in certain places but overall i think we see a lot of new growth um so you'll see the the loyalists like yourself or adam or you know some of the other guys that are out here every year every time we're in town um and that's pretty typical all across the country but we see a lot of new faces i mean i think today from last year when i was here i probably saw another 15 or so different people that i hadn't seen before um so that's it's it's something that we will continue to do just because it's, it's a great promotional thing for us. It's a great value for the players, and, uh, and we love, love doing it. It's a, it's a fun, casual, laid-back atmosphere outside of you know, normal tournament play. Anything new with DD this year? Anything coming up? Anything cool, new, interesting gadgets or anything that we, we're going to need or we're going to find out that we need? Um, there, there is a new uh, Zuka cart coming out. Whoa. Um, that we're hoping to have out by winter, by Christmas. Um, but it's going to be, it, there are two new versions of it. Uh, I don't want to spill all the beans on it yet. But, um, but for those of you that carry big bags, you'll be excited about this one. So it'll, uh, it'll be a lot more conducive for those that are carrying the, the H2O bag or the lap bag and things like that. And probably one of the most anticipated discs right now, the Deputy, it's coming out in the uh, the burst mold plastic. Really excited about that. I just saw some really cool images from those. Yeah, the Deputy craze is, uh, is about to be fulfilled for a lot of people that have been asking for Deputies, which we couldn't sell for the last, you know, five months. Um, but yeah, we've got that, you know, they put that awesome picture of the burst ones coming out. Um, not to break everybody's heart, but those, I don't believe, are going to be what you're receiving on Friday when those come out. Those are, um, those, they, I don't think we got as many of those as we thought we were, so doing a mass release of that was not gonna be conducive, so I think we're gonna, you're gonna see those for tournament sponsorship discs and things like that. Um, 
over the next few months. So if you're running a tournament anytime soon, get on the order form Friday and uh, you might be able to pull out some of those first deputies. Yeah, we love whenever you come to town. So anytime you want to come to Pittsburgh, you just let us know. Absolutely. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, that's going to do it for our review with Jonathan Ray. Anything else you want to add? I'm good. I just love being here. Thanks for everything, guys. Love uh, love coming to town, seeing seeing you guys. You guys were up at Pocono with us last weekend, so um, it's been it's been a fun fun end of the year. Yeah. Couple 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 of days left, and then I'm I'm headed home. <laughs> Great. Well, hey, have a safe trip home. It was good to see you again. Absolutely. Thanks. So, all right, guys. Until next time, remember to like us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, like, comment, share. We always appreciate it whenever you guys do that. So, until next time. Keep banging those chains.